Fix your eye. You're in already, yeah? No. I'm not getting in. <laughs> I'm okay, it's okay. It'll work. <laughs> just hope it's okay. okay. Well, well, we've just completed the first day on this installation, so we're halfway through it. Um, we're trying to do outtakes and everybody's on it, so this, these guys have been working all day. Go and have a look. Go and have a look at what we've done so far. So, we have actually haven't connected any AC, and so all we've done is we've got the four batteries connected, they put the, the trunk in, we've done, what we've done is we've actually run the cables to the inverters, we've got two battery isolators, and it's got a return, I'll give, I can put a circuit diagram how we've done it, and as I said before, this is the three phase inverter, this is a single phase inverter. At this point in time, we haven't connected any AC, nothing, we haven't powered the AC up. And what we were looking for is to make sure we were getting comms onto the battery. And in fact, here, we can see here, we've got clear communications on the battery. Um, and after about, we, we've already tested after a couple of, mi couple of minutes powering up, the inverter goes back to, uh, goes to normal. So we know, in fact, you just hit the click, the click, click, click. So, so you can see here, the normal light is now lit up and the normal light is lit up on the upper inverter, the charge inverter. So we know both these inverters are working we know we get good. All the batteries are communicating to each other, so the batteries are now talking to each other. In, and it's a very unusual configuration because this is not a parallel configuration. This is like a, 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 a charger and a master. Um, so the, the, the charger is not really a slave. It's not communicating like a slave. It's just purely a charger. And, and this one, which is the charger, is the one that's communicating to the batteries. So this, the BMS, is on this one to the batteries, not this one. Um, so we'll, we'll follow through. Tomorrow we're going to have to reconfigure the switchboard to, to, to three phase um, and then we'll put the feed in from the site into this one so it'll start charging and this one is the output. So what I might do, um, well we've got a little bit of time now, we will put power on this first inverter, the charger inverter, so we can charge the batteries up and we can charge the batteries up overnight. I think that's probably quite a good idea. So we'll do that now and it's sort of 10 to 6, they've been at it all day. We've been trying to get parts everywhere because it's a bit difficult sometimes from here trying to find the parts, but it's all good. And we'll charge the batteries up now and leave it running overnight. And then tomorrow we'll connect all the AC up and we'll rewire, rewire the switchboard. And hopefully job is finished, it'll be functioning. Thank you.